Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. I am in my large Dollar Tree today. Right now, I might go over to the smaller one. I want to show you guys all the storage stuff that they have out. They're so pretty. They got the big baskets down here. They got the baskets with the handles and the blue and the black. They've got all the shoebox containers. They got the sandwich and compartment containers for the kids. These are so pretty. They've got these right here. Gray, green, teal, and pink. Ooh, look at these. These are pretty. Like the letter holders or basket, basket painters or whatever. These are pretty. They got them in the green, that gray, teal, and pink. They've got all of these little baskets. So they got a lot of storage containers ready for you to reorganize your home. And they got these, I showed you these before, in the different colors. The green and the pink and the gray. Gray is back there. What this is the gray right here. All right, let's look at what dishes out. The plates. Who are these from? Um, Royal Norfolk with the matching mugs, dish towels, and they have it in the blue. And they have the saucers in the blue, but I don't see the saucers in the uh, red. But they have the bowls. And then they have the silver charger plates, two different kinds. They have these little salt and pepper shakers. And they have the matching dish towels for the blue. Washcloths and other mitts. They have some new bath mats in different colors. These are so cute. These are $5. Look at this yellow one, y'all in the square. That's pretty. I see the um, Reef my Wally Wallabies, soft and green. These are the green apples. They were good. I like them. Uh, expiration date is June. Let me see. They got them all stamped over here. December something 2023. December 1st, 2023. And they also have um, restocked the watermelon ones. These are my girls, <laughs> Gail's favorite ones. And they have these coastal peppermint mints. I haven't seen those in a minute. And they have the ones in the wintergreen. These are nice. It's a Saturday here, y'all. And this place is crack a -lack, And that's why I'm talking low. Our food area is just a hot mess, as always. We have nothing especially nothing new but i see some hostess ho-hos that they restock they've got some zingers ice vanilla zingers and the snowballs the pink snowballs the hostess cupcakes birthday cakes so they do have twinkies and the coffee cakes Okay, my face it's a little dark in here because you know they've got all the balloons up. But this is what my local Dollar Tree has put out so far. Some of the stuff. This is the chick. A lot of DIY stuff. This is the eight piece egg. The paws. The chick. The eggs. Ten piece rabbits. Ten piece carrots. So some of them are eight piece and some of them are 10 piece. Then they've got all the bird houses down here. They've got those. They've got the trees. They've got the scrap collectors and the buckets in blue, purple, and yellow. And they have the bunnies over here. And they have all the pretty beads. And they have the two pack eggs in yellow, blue, purple, and pink. If you could see that back there. And they have the DIY 
I got these upside down. But this is this one. Let me see how I can do this. That's a little gnome with the bunny. I'm trying to take this off. Right, hold on. Oh boy, it's stuck. So they got this one with the gnome and the bunny. And they have them all hanging upside down. And they have that one that's with Easter. They got all the craft fabric up here. I can't really see it. Those are pretty. And here we have the DIY decors. Um, the 12 pack of bunnies with the little tails. The 14 piece eggs. 14 piece bunnies. All DIYs. These are little carrots. Little chicks. These are cute. And here's the sequin paper. Looks like yellow purple and gold what I'm seeing right now most of this other stuff I've showed you already <clears throat> I'm probably gonna go over to the smell of Dollar Tree see what they've gotten up so far I've got all the um, mesh ribbon up here three forms the bunny and the egg there's those mini carrots and the ribbon is so pretty. God, I love that. Look at that. That is so pretty. Got this one. Oh, they, they got a lot of um, Easter ribbon. They got some beads. And these eggs are two piece styrofoam eggs. And then we got the color ones over there. Okay, my sweets, I'm going down the Dollar Tree Plus aisle right now. Let's see what they have. Those are cute for $3. I love these right here for $5. We've got the bigger bunnies up here for $5. Got this one for $5. Shows you all the carrots and stuff before. Got some cute ones. These look real. Let's see how much they are. They're five dollars. They got these. They're really cute. They're the metal in the different colors for three dollars. They have a beige, lime green, a blue. Mhm. Mm they got these up here. This is um, blessed for three dollars. Welcome. These are cute and only three dollars. That's not a bad price at all. Um, let's see what else. Uh, this one just says hop on in. Hope you can see that. It says hop on in. Sorry. For three dollars. That's not bad at all. I knew that was going to happen. Hold on. Let me fix that. You can see it a little bit better. It has the bunny metal pieces hanging from it. Some of them have the eggs and the carrots. Very, very cute. These are the ones that I bought. I bought one of those for $5, I believe. Yeah, $5. Really cute. Easter blessing. I was looking for it in the blue, and they didn't have it then. I might bring mine back and exchange it. Well, we have door hangers for $5. I think I showed you these garlands. They got lots and lots of cute towels. These are two packs, I think. Yeah, these are two packs for $3. So you got one that looks like hop to it. And the other one is just green. This one says... I'm eggs extra special. <laughs> and then solid yellow. This one says hip, hip hop. And you don't stop. Oh, Lord. <laughs> In the white. Just green on the back. Then they have this one, which is somebody loves me. 
Then they have the silicone oven mitts and the Easter motif for three dollars. They have the two layer cupcake holder tear tray that's pretty for uh, five dollars. That one's five dollars. I've never seen them put out a big package like this. This is the fashion doll. Um, green bro with the boots and the purse. Yeah. Green right International. So they're all the same. Those are cute. They have this one with the airline um, stewardess with her suitcase. They've got a nurse one right here. And I guess it's a snorkel one. <laughs> they're cute. Wow. Okay, my sweets. I am over here at the small Dollar Tree looking at some of their little Easter steaks. These all look the, the same. They're cute though. They've got all their eggs up. More eggs over here. Some Easter baskets. And the usual stuff we've been seeing. Um... We've got the Nomi's up here. I still love that lime green. Wow. Oh, I didn't see these carrots. These are only nine piece felt stickers. Those are cute. Uh, let's see what kind of decorations they got. Oh, they got some more of the steaks down here. I think I got some of these last year. Uh, let's see kind of bent up. Yeah, I think I got some of these. Here's some more steaks for the yard. Easter blessings. Everybody welcome. I think I still have that one from last year. And there's the bunnies on the bicycles. I was telling you guys about Happy Easter in the pink and Happy Easter in the blue. And they had this bunny in the white with the titanium ear. Hippity hoppity, and this is the one I just showed you guys, the brown one. And the different packs of the gnomes. You got the ones with the gingham. Looks like pink, blue, green, maybe a purple in there, I'm not sure. I think I got this one, but I like those too. Some of the fresh chopping boards. Some more mistakes down here. Hippity hop with the bunnies, the little tails. We got this one in the burlap and the gingham. And this one, Easter bunny stuff here with all the burlap. And then we have these love, hope, and faith. Those are cute. Let's see what we have over this side. Yeah, all this stuff we've seen before. Oh, they did put out the little decorations. Cottontails, candy cafe, jelly beans, and uh, <laughs> bunny bait, fresh carrots. Those are cute. Let's see if they have any ones different. Oh, oh wait a minute. Here we go. Something here. Treats for my peeps <laughs> in the purple. <laughs> Treats for my peeps. Let's see. Yep. So the purple, the beige, and the blue. And they still have the little gumball machines. And they have some more uh, decorations over here. I was looking for a Pacific one that I don't see. But these are cute. Easter blessings. Happy Easter. And these with the bunnies on them. And Marina showed us how to turn them over. And it says, follow the bunny. He has chocolate. So these are double-sided. <clears throat> so you see this on this side. And then the bunny with the little cotton tail on that side. And this one's the same. Did some, some bunny say Easter? And then you have the little pink bunny on the back. That's nice. Double-sided. I think they had these last year. Happy Easter with the little feet. And of course they've got all the 
shopping blocks, but these are new this year. Welcome to Cottontail Farms. Welcome to our cabbage, our carrot patch. I almost said cabbage patch, like cabbage patch dolls. <laughs> so yeah, these are all the same. And these are a little on our raised side. So that's cute. And I showed you guys these already. <clears throat> but they're not showing the one I was looking for. Even though that one's cute right there. I like it. They do have the soaps out. And I got those already. Haven't seen the Easter candy yet. I think I found one piece of Easter candy over at the large dollar tray. Wow. They restocked the St. Patty gnomes. They got a lot. They must have got another shipment in. I like those glasses, suspenders, the ties. <clears throat> We've seen most of this stuff. Okay, this is not my music. I do not own it. Hello, my beautiful sweet. Sweet Sadie J, coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening. Whatever time you're watching this video, you guys, I finally, finally did a little grocery shopping. Not a big one, but a little one. I went to Aldi's, Food Lion, and Walmart, and I picked up just a few items from the Dollar Tree. So let's jump right into this. I was looking for wings, but um, the wings at Aldi's, they only had the big giant pack, which my sister and I don't eat all that chicken. So I got these little... Um, these were the cheapest ones I could find. It's never any cage, never any cage-free raised with, and it tells you all the stuff here. And they were only five ninety-two for some chicken breast tenderloins, which I will cut up and make into little finger chickens and fry those. And I found uh, some of my pot stickers, y'all. I haven't seen these at the Dollar Tree in eons, but all these has these and. Um, let me grab the receipt so I can tell you guys how much all this stuff was. Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay, my sweets. I'm back. The pot stickers were uh, $3.99 for a 16-ounce bag. And I'm telling you, I love these. They had the pork ones and they had the chicken ones. So I got the chicken ones. I got two bags of my broccoli florets that I absolutely love from all these. These are the season's choice. And they were 97 cents a bag. I got one box of my French vanilla pods, $3.99. Eggs weren't badly priced, and I didn't know if we needed them, so I got them because these are the cheapest I've seen in a while for a dozen. They were da -da 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 -da. $3.61 for a dozen of eggs. That's the cheapest I've seen, and I don't know when. And these strawberries looked absolutely beautiful. So I got a thing of strawberries, which was $2.95. The butter was a little bit higher than I expected, but I went ahead and got it because we needed butter. And they were $3.98 for four quarters. And I needed some more honey, the real stuff, not the Dollar Tree stuff. And the honey was la 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 $3.89. And I told y'all I love all these hot chocolate, and that is $1.25 for eight packs um, of hot chocolate. I got my favorite um, salad dressing. I usually like the light, but Aldi's does not sell the light balsamic vinaigrette, so I just get this one. It's not bad with the carbs and the sugar and stuff, so it's uh, calories 60 grams for two tablespoons, the carbs are four grams, and the sugars are uh, four grams. So that's not bad. I think that was like 195. Uh, yep, 195. And of course, y'all know I gotta get my zero French vanilla creamer, and that was only 249. And then I got a bag of my sweet butter lettuce for when I want a salad. I think the strawberries. Did I tell you how much the strawberries were? Yeah, two ninety five for the strawberries, and the sweet butter lettuce was only two sixty nine. So I thought that was a great deal at all these. And I'm going to put this stuff away real quick, and then I'll come back and show you what I got from Food Lion okay, and my Walmart. sweets. These are the few little items that I picked up from Food Lion. I did find a small little pack of wings that was affordable, so I got this, 
at $6.70, just a food line brand. I decided to cut corners um, and buy some pita bread. This is out of the deli, and this is um, Joseph's, I think, Joseph's Original Pitas, and I will be making um, miniature pizzas out of this. I got eight of my diet tonic waters from Food Lion. You're only seeing three because I put the rest away. My sister went out while I went out, and she found some Utz Honey Barbecue Potato Chips, so she got two because they were on sale. Two for five dollars, so she got those. I bought the little cheap <laughs> Food Lion tortilla nacho cheese flavored chips to go with the Salasista um, salsa that I bought from the Dollar Tree. And I bought those two bags of the Albanese um, gummy bears from the Dollar Tree, the two small ones. I went back to get some more because they are so good and they did not have any. So <clears throat> they had this big bag at um, Food Line for two two forty nine, dollars I believe. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. The bears, two seventy nine dollars for the big bag of these gummy bears. They are so so delicious so I went ahead and splurged and got a big bag of those and then I went to Walmart's oh no this is Aldi sorry I went to Walmart's I got some more mozzarella cheese for the pizza we needed some sugar so I got a four pound or five, five pound bag four pound of sugar I got this little banana cream jello pudding for the um, cool whip and the vanilla wafers I got some sour cream because they didn't have any of the smaller ones left, so I got this one. I got a small little shrimp cocktail platter, a few little, um, one little roll of the ground turkey, 90% 90, 90 lean, in case I want to make some sweet and sour meatballs. I don't know if I'm going to make all this or not, y'all. You know, my brain's just fried. I got a cucumber, two um, tomatoes, and I got some vegetable oil for frying the chicken. And I'm going to show you the small little Dollar Tree haul coming right up. <laughs> okay, my beautiful sweets. <laughs> Sorry for laughing. I'm laughing at my sister. <laughs> but these are the few little items that I picked up from my um, from the Dollar Tree. They didn't really have a whole lot going on. I have a small little walkthrough um, before this video of the grocery haul. But I did pick up some of their TJ Farms steak cut potato fries. I've never tried these before. And so I figured, eh, I'll make a pan of these and put some french fry seasoning on them to go along with the noshing. I did get another box of the best, the Bob's Best vanilla wafers to make my little vanilla pudding, whatever. Sissy made another pan of brownies, but that'll probably be gone before we even get to make the pudding. I didn't know she had bought some potato chips. And of course, the Dollar Tree is out completely of all the honey barbecue ones, but she picked them up at Food Line, so yay. So we got onion and garlic, we got tortilla chips, and we've got um, the honey barbecue chips for the dip. And um, I did they did restock the Wiley Wallaby green apple and watermelon at the Dollar Tree. I just got one just for a little snack. And this was the only Easter candy that I've see, seen out so far. And these are the Haribo Happy Hoppers. <laughs> and they are, let's see, I'm trying to see if they have the flavor on them, but it doesn't matter. They're the little bunnies, if you guys can see the little bunnies in there. And um, that was the only Easter candy I saw out so far, but they're getting the stuff out now. And I did go back and pick up the white. I showed you guys this in the pink. But I went back and got the white because I figured I could use these little cotton balls as the little bunny tails on my um, pillowcases. So I got those. And this thing I have been eyeballing and eyeballing and eyeballing and said, no, I don't need it. And I just changed my mind today because I found it in the green. Normally, I've always seen it in the white only. I don't know if they had any more colors because I got so excited when I saw the green. I just grabbed it and kept it moving. But this was so pretty, $5 for the two-layer cupcake holder. This is going to be my Easter tear tray, and I love it. I'm thinking like, oh my God, just to get it in that different um, color. And of course, there's the directions, and $5. So that is it, you guys. That is it for my grocery haul and my small little Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. 
Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. Happy Super Bowl Sunday to everyone. I hope your team wins. Go Eagles. They don't win. I'm turning it off. Anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And everyone, have a blessed day. Bye, guys. Hey, my beautiful sweets. Just wanted to jump on real quick and show you what I made for me and Sissy Super Bowl Sunday. I made a nice bowl of salad, something healthy. I made some deviled eggs. I bought a small little shrimp cocktail tray. I made some homemade cheese pizza. I made fried chicken wings and fried chicken breasts. I made honey barbecue meatballs. And then for dessert, we've got homemade banana pudding and some brownies. Happy Super Bowl Sunday, everyone. Bye, guys.